What's up everyone, Takedown here. Welcome back to another hockey card video. Today we are going to be opening up a product on the channel, but first I wanted to show you guys my mistake of what I bought for Boxing Day. Now, we're going to start with this uh, box here. Originally, this local shop did have a great deal, and we did get some pretty cool stuff. However, I bought the wrong items from them, and I'll explain shortly. So, what we ended up picking up was a... Retail box of 2021-22 Upper Deck Series 1. They did throw in a pack of sleeves, which is awesome. I love getting free stuff. I did also order the 21-22 uh, Complete Rookie Sets. Hopefully we can get an autograph out of that. And we also ordered a tin for the same year for Series 1. Now the tin, I believe, was $30. That's what it was on sale for. The retail box, I think, was 60 regular 100 and the rookie box was $25. But whenever I placed the order, I didn't realize at the time that that's not the year that I was looking for. What I was actually looking for, I ended up having to place an order for it, and that is what's in this box here. So I am still going to keep the other and open it up on the channel, but I honestly ordered the wrong year of what I was looking to complete. So we did order, because it was on sale, 2021-22 Series 2 uh, Blaster Box. And this is what I actually intended on ordering. Oh, first, they actually gave us more sleeves. I didn't realize that in this box. We have a retail box for 2020-21. That's actually what I intended on ordering whenever I was looking up what their Boxing Day sales were. That was regular 125 I think I had it for 110 and then I also got a tin because I did still want to uh, open a tin for the same year. So 2020-21 Series 1 Upper Deck. This here I think was $40, regular $60. So that is everything that we got. So I think today we're going to open up, I think... We're going to go with this tin here. So everything that I just shared with you guys, expect to see those being opened over the next couple weeks or possibly next couple months. Uh, but again, we're going to be starting with the tin for the 2020-21 Series 1 Upper Deck. And hopefully we do get some cool stuff out of this. I'm actually looking to complete the complete base set, but also I'm looking for a ton of rookies as well. So we're going to open up here. I actually love the design of this year's tin. That looks amazing. See if I can open it up here. And then we also have the Glossy Opeachy for the same year. So let's see what we have inside. Take out all the packs first. And get to opening these up. We're going to start with the uh, Rookie Glossy Opeachy Pack. Oh, we got uh, Cleaver Bellows. Let's see if I can focus here. Uh, we have a bordered one. I don't know, bronze bordered. I'm not sure the with this set here. We did get Jake Evans. And we also got the regular one for Bellows as well. So that's pretty cool. Put these off to the side. Now we're going to open up a bunch of these packs. We have in total eight, nine packs. So this splash box, you do get nine packs. And then also the uh, glossy pack. So I'm going for a complete base set. Check that off camera. And this is a base pack. Which is awesome for me trying to get a complete base set. But it's not good because I also want some of the inserts. Uh, and I do want some of the um, Young Guns. That's what we're looking for. Some of the ones I don't have and some of the more valuable ones. Uh, we did get a canvas for Sebastian Aho. I like collecting the canvas. The rest are all base. Nick Suzuki. There we go, let it focus. Uh, we did get a Young Guns. I believe I already have this one from Nicholas Bowden. Base, base. Looks like another base pack. Ok, 
Kevin Philia. Oh, I do see something shiny. We did get a Drastal uh, Dazzler. I don't think I've gotten an orange Dazzler yet. But I do like the Dazzlers. We have four packs left. We did get a portrait. Uh, upper deck portrait for Travis Constany. I always butcher names. No exception here. Connor McDavid. Hopefully that equals some luck. And it's complete base pack. So not too much luck. Two packs left. Only one Young Guns. We should be getting two on average per tin, since there's nine packs in here. Oh, did get our second one here for Joseph Wall for Toronto. I don't have this one, so that's a nice one for me. And our last pack, hopefully we can get something good. I'm looking for Young Guns, anything literally, so let's see. Oh, we did get another canvas. I have good luck with these canvas cards now, apparently. For Quinn Hughes. That is a really nice one. That's definitely staying in my personal collection for sure. And obviously the rest are all base. Not too bad. We did get a stack of base cards. So hopefully I can get a complete set for that year. Uh, but we do have some more stuff to open up. So look forward to a couple more videos coming out soon. We have two retail boxes, another tin. Uh, we do have the mystery tins from Walmart as well. So hope you guys enjoyed this hockey card video. I'll see you guys in the next one. Please take care. Peace.